Be sober, be vigilant. Resist. Second stage of the formula. This is the easy part. It's down in the next, down in verse number 10, down there by 10 and 11. He says, and the very God of peace, this is how you end up strong. Strength just don't fall on you. You got to work for strength. Any believer, any Christian that you think is strong, they have paid a dear price for that strength. What I'm doing here, this is work right here. I am working against principalities. I'm working against powers. I'm working against spiritual witness in the atmosphere. This is work what I'm doing right here. This is work. Some of y'all have sleepy. So I got to pray that God lets this word get in your spirit. Before the enemy snatches it from your ears. This is a work. And the very God whose glory you're trying to receive after that you have suffered. It's in the text. Because being sober and vigilant and resisting is going to cause you, <laughs> believe me, to suffer. So after that you have suffered a while, part two of the formula, the Lord will make you perfect perfect it doesn't mean that you're going to live the rest of your life without having occasion to make a mistake that's not what perfect means when I looked it up in the original setting of the text perfect means it's like a doctor who has the ability to set broken bones in perfect So when Peter says here, after you've said that a while, the Lord will make you perfect. The Lord will pick up the broken pieces of your life and perfectly put you back together again. It's what they meant in the Old Testament when they said the devil meant it. For evil, but God has perfectly adjusted my life. So what the enemy set up to destroy me, God used it to bless me. I got anybody in here today that's living on the perfection. Of the mighty hand of God. You need to praise him. Because he can fix it. You should have committed suicide. But he fixed it. You should be laying in a graveyard somewhere. But God fixed it. Praise him for fixing. Sit, he says something else, Sid. He'll make you perfect. Then he will establish you. He'll make you perfect. He'll arrange the broken pieces so that it makes sense. He'll establish. He will stabilize you. He will set you up permanently. Th that's what establish means. He going to take everything that they said about you while they watch you struggle through it and he going to permanently give you a victory 
right in front of their face. Hit somebody on the shoulder and say, neighbor, what's coming for me is better than what has been. God getting ready to do something permanently. Those same people who laughed at you, the same people that were happy because you were down, they ain't going to know what to do with you when you get up. Because when you finally look around and realize that everything that the enemy had set to destroy you, God has given you power over it, you're going to give God a ridiculous praise. I said, I'm going to give him a crazy praise. When everybody you pray for is saved, they don't know how they got saved. When every dime you had went out of your pocket, but now you got money in a bank. You going to give God a ridiculous praise. And I got anybody in here today who can praise him for what's going to happen? I tell you to open up your mouth and clap your hands. And give God a praise on credit. one more. Sit down. I got one more. He gonna make you perfect. Sit down. No, sit down. He gonna establish you. <laughs> he gonna permanently set you up. Then he said, I'm gonna give you strength. So you're gonna be stronger in the end than you were when you started. Tell your neighbor, I'm going to end up strong. I'm not strong right now. But you just keep watching me. I'm going to end up strong. Because the Lord going to give me some strength. He going to give me the ability to walk all over it. Satan, I command you. In the name of the Lord. Pick up your weapons and flee. For God has given me authority to walk all over. You don't got anybody in here that can walk all over. Say that I command you in the name of the Lord. Pick up your weapons and flee. Walk on it, honey. Walk on your deliverance. Walk on your blessing. Walk on it. Walk on the miracle. Walk on it. Walk out of temptation. Walk out of the trial. Yes. Sit down, I got one more. He gonna make me perfect.